for being a career criminal and lifelong con artist, Donald Trump is a remarkably bad poker player. Some people have a subtle tell that tips you off what kind of hand they've got. Trump just lies to you about the cards he's holding, and his lie are so unimaginative, it becomes easy to figure out what he thinks he's got up his sleeve. Over a 14-hour period on Sunday, Donald Trump posted nearly two dozen tweets and retweets. Most of them were frantic, deranged, or some combination of both. By the time he was done, he had attacked everyone from John McCain to some local union boss to Saturday Night Live, and in the process he gave something away. We all know what Trump's Twitter feed looks like when he's bored on the weekend. But this was something far more. Trump has a series of go-to moves when he's trying to generate controversy, so it'll get headlines and thus serve as a distraction from whatever he wants us not to pay attention to. Trump went through all his greatest hits on Sunday, making clear that he's desperately trying to ensure that at least some of Monday's headlines are about his Twitter meltdown, as opposed to what they should be about. Donald Trump does this whenever he thinks a major bombshell is about to land on him. Has he been tipped off by the Justice Department about a specific Robert Mueller move? Has the media asked him to comment on a big news story about one of his scandals and he knows it's about to be published? Or is Trump just watching everything closing in on him and convincing himself that it's all about to crush him this week? Stay tuned. His supersized meltdown today wasn't about nothing, that's for sure.